Hey guys, welcome to my new Napoleon Total War online battle. This is on the Ligny map. I'm not sure that's how you pronounce it, but that's how it's spelled and looks to me, so. <laughs> uh, I am playing Jean Lanes, or Lane, I don't know. Jean Lanes, I'll call him. Jean Lanes. And he is playing as Prussia, uh, not Prussia, bloody hell, uh, Austria. And I am playing as uh, Denmark on this one. <clears throat> I didn't, you know, I've never really used Denmark before. I think probably did once a while ago. And I, I know I played him, played as them on um, Empire Total War a couple times. Uh, but, yeah. I figured, what the hell. I was bored and needed a battle. Alright, here's... From my right to left, I have a Dragoon, a Light Dragoon, uh, two more Light Dragoons, and one more heavy, uh, one more Dragoon over here, regular Dragoon, whatever. <laughs> uh, I have Norwegian Ski Troops, Sharpshooters, uh, more Sharpshooters, Norwegian Ski Troops, and more Sharpshooters. So I had one, two, three, four, five five uh, skirmisher units. I also have a seven pound howitzer here. Uh, another seven pound howitzer here. I also have one, two, three, four line infantry and two lifeguards afoot. And I have just the basic general staff. My opponent has from his right to left. Uh, I like how my uh, shot, my uh, artillery shots right here hovering them. As you can see it right there. <laughs> okay. Uh, he had a seven pound howitzer, two of those. <clears throat> he had three, four, five, six German fusiliers. An Arch, Arch, an Archduke Charles Legion, Hungarian Fusiliers. He had one, two, three, four of those, plus two Landen Schützen, uh, plus he yeah, three, three Landen Landes Schützen. He also had two Hungarian Hussars, and he brought a General Staff as well. So let's. Get this underway here. I do manage to route one of his uh, howitzers soon, or the next few minutes here. But his other other howitzer is just in behind the hill, so he, I can't really get to him. <laughs> All right, now most of the time when I play on this map. I think I've only played it twice before on, on 1v1 and I usually lose. I usually get my ass handed to me. But uh, I'm hoping I might win this one. I don't know. <laughs> and uh, I never really noticed all the uh, bridges and stuff in the last two times I played on this battle. So I was, you can see there's one here, so I guess that's in case I want to retreat and go up here, there's a red line, but I don't. <laughs> I have a high ground here and by gun I'll This building it. has fallen to the enemy. He did pretty, he did something smart, he, uh, he began taking buildings and fortifying them. So he takes like three or four buildings, this one, that, uh. What's this one? This one's a farmhouse, another farmhouse, and this, yeah, no, another farmhouse. I thought they were something different, a church maybe or something, but, oh well. Let's see, I also bring two of my units down here, cavalry units down here. Sorry. With his units moving over this way, I thought he might try to cross over and come behind me, but he didn't. 
So right now I'm deploying my people as best as possible. I'm trying to move to the flanks to d divide his attention. Uh, his attention. So I'm moving one of my sharpshooters over here, uh, as well as my life two lifeguard to foot over here. These two uh, sharpshooter, the sharpshooter, and this uh, Norwegian troop is moving here. So you put some fire on them if they come, try to come across that bridge. And these two units are moving to support them and my artillery. And also I have three units of uh, cavalry here to back these guys up if needed. And there goes one this of his building has fallen to the enemy. howitzers. I like how, how, what is, how it sounds when they break in. It's like... Ch -ch 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 -ch. <laughs> He's gonna put two units in there. Yeah, I think he puts one or two in each. Yeah, two in that one. Only one in that one so far. He, he, he's uh, shooting hell out of this one, this uh, artillery piece. Yeah, the, uh, the limber thingies are and the horse teams are killed on this one. These two are okay, though. Boop. There goes a couple of my people. Aww. He's dead. There we go. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> Over here, I'm moving my units in a flanking maneuver. So I'm going to bring them over here, cross this bridge, put them over here, wait a second or two, see if he notices and moves uh, units to uh, intercept. If he doesn't, then I will come over here, cross this bridge, and try to hit him on the flanks. But he sees it eventually. <laughs> Basically, at first, it looked like it was going to be a standoff. Because he wasn't going to budge across the bridges. He wasn't coming. He was just going to fortify and hold out. But, I had other plans. Yeah. I probably should have kept, uh,. Focusing on his artillery, but eventually I uh, switched fire to try to take out some of his infantry or weaken some of his infantry. After a while, my cannon stopped firing, so I don't know if they ran out of ammo or if they just didn't have enough people to fire their weapons anymore. <laughs> here goes my cavalry units over here. Basically, I'm, I'm just, it's like chess. You put your pieces in position and then you strike. And I'm not very good at chess, but <laughs> I did learn that while I was in some sort of chess club in school. <laughs> but uh, it seems like for me a battlefield is easier than a chess board. Because the chess board is kind of restrictive with movements and stuff. These are much more fluid. Yeah, now I'm bringing them over here. This this uh, flank will sort of stay static for a while. Basically, it's just to keep these guys in place while I hit them on my right hook. And my right hook is right here. And eventually, I will move those over, like I said before. So far, he hasn't reacted to it, but he will. Da, 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 da. And there goes my cavalry, crossing that this bridge.
think these guys are almost dead. Yeah, this 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 can is not even fired anymore because it's only got three people, I guess. Same over here. Why don't you just go over and help these guys? Oh, why don't you you be the loader? See, look, dumbasses. Alright. I am. Bring it over my cab into this tree line here. 